Russia and Ghana are linked by nearly 60 years of diplomatic relations. But business relations between the two countries are not well developed. According to President Nana Okufu Ado, Ghana is ready to deepen its business ties with Russia. He explained to a Russian business delegation the vast and available resources the country has to offer, as well as the good socio-economic environment Russia will have should its investors choose to set up businesses in Ghana. I want to revive the very strong relations that there used to exist between Ghana and the then Soviet Union, Russia, the then Soviet Union. In the early years of our independence, the Soviet Union was extremely supportive of Ghana's independence and assisted with many important developments in our country in several areas. Then issues, political issues occurred. Russia sort of withdrew from West Africa, from Ghana, and recently has been gradually coming back. And the two or three companies around the table that are already doing work in Ghana is a sign of that. But I think it is a sign that we need to accelerate. We have important Russian companies in the energy sector who are involved in the country. Blue Coil is an uh, important player in the upstream uh, petroleum industry in Ghana. So is uh, in the trading area, and Tasco is with us. And then Rosneft is also getting involved in Ghana in the gas supply and energy sector. These are all pointers to the relationship that, that I want to build uh, with Russia. And that is the principal reason I came, to revive the very strong relations that there used to exist between Ghana and the then Soviet Union, Russia, the then Soviet Union. In the early years of our independence, the Soviet Union was extremely supportive of Ghana's independence. and assisted with many important developments in our country in several areas. Then issues, political issues occurred. Russia sort of withdrew from West Africa, from Ghana, and recently has been gradually coming back. And the two or three companies around the table that are already doing work in Ghana is a sign of that. On his part, the CEO of the Ghana Investment Promotion Center, Yofi Grant, who was also part of the visit, encouraged Russia not to miss out on the investment opportunities the Africa Continental Free Trade Agreement has to offer. As uh, we are currently hosting the Africa Continental Free Trade Agreement, that's the Ghana headquarters. So we are driving industry and trade in Africa and we would like you to come and partner with us. We, we are um, ready to receive and we would like to engage with you. Um, so thank you very much and um, we are ready to assist you to uh, achieve your investment needs.